Welcome to Rover YouTube channel. Today I am going to show you, how to create a automated backup process for your Microsoft Access database. Ok, let's go to the video. This is my contact database and I am going to add a backup facility to this simple database. Then our first step is to add a module to this database. Then, how to add a module to our database. It is very simple. Select the Create tab and click on the module. Now you can see a new window opened and new module added to our database. Now we are in VBA mode. You can rename this module as you need. To rename just go to the module properties window. And select name and give a desired name for your module. I rename this module as mod01. Then we need to add a small coding part to our module. Ok. This is the code, I am going to add my module. I just copy and paste it to my module like this. Please look at the code, I added to my module. There you can change the backup interval, by changing the time value part of our codes. There you can give any time interval as you need. For example, if you set a time here to 1 hour, your database will back up after 1 hour. According to the path given by this code, your database backup file saves to the same location, where your original database file exists. I have named this function as run sub and it is useful to run macro command later. Ok, then save and exit from the VBA mode. Then, next step is to create a macro to run our backup process when database starts. To create a new macro select the create tab and click on the macro. Through here you can see a drop down box like this. Click on the drop down box and select run code from the list. And enter the run sub as function name. Save the macro as auto exec, and close the window. Now close the database and reopen it like this. Once you open the database you can see a input box and it shows the scheduled backup time. Then press OK. Wait for a 1 minute because I set the backup time to 1 minute for testing purpose. Yes, when the backup time is reached, it runs backup process automatically as shown in the video. Close the database and let's check the backup location. Yes, our database is backed up and it has been saved by backup date. Now I think that you learn how to add automate backup process to your database. 
If you need any clarification please put a comment. Do not forget to subscribe Rover YouTube channel for latest videos like this. Thank you.